Hello Makers, Melly here from AGF. Welcome to the AGF Quilt Block Collection. Does anybody know what time it is? It's Quilt Block Tutorial time! I always get so excited to share new quilt block tutorials with you, and I love it when you sew along with me. Today I have a brand new block to share with you. So, without further ado, let me introduce you to the Star Spindle Block, which I made with our brand new AGF capsule collection called Craftbound. Make sure to stick around to the end of the video to see how easy this block comes together. If you're new to our channel and love quilting as much as we do, don't forget to subscribe below to watch more fun sewing tutorials like this one. Check out the description box below to find all the cutting requirements and step-by-step -step instructions. To make four to time half square triangles, you will need a six inch square from fabric C and D. Place them right sides together and sew at 1 4 inch around all the sides of your square. With a straight edge and a rotary cutter, cut your piece on both diagonals to reveal four half square triangles. Trim your half square triangles to three and a half inches. To create your center block, sew your three rows together like this, making sure you press your seams in alternating directions so your seams will match up perfectly. Take all of your one and a half inch wide strips and place a one and a half inch square on each end of your strip like this. Draw a diagonal line with a fabric marking pen on each square, making sure half of your lines are going to the right and the other to the left. Sew on the diagonal line you drew and trim your seam allowance to 1 4 inch. Press your pieces open and sew your same length strips together as follows. Sew your top and bottom borders to your center block. Now you can attach your side borders in the same manner. Looking good. The last step is to draw a diagonal line on your two and a half inch squares from fabric F and place them in each corner of your block like this. Sew on the line you drew and trim up your seam allowances to 1 4 inch. Press your corners out and your star spindle block is complete. Make sure to share your quilt block creations made with AGF fabrics on social media using the hashtag AGF Quilt Block Collection. Great job! Our star spindle block is complete and I definitely can't wait to incorporate this block into one of my new quilting projects. I'm thinking of making a table runner to brighten up my desk at work. What do you think? If you're always in search of sewing and quilting inspiration, make sure to check out the new AGF Capsules lookbook. It's filled with great projects and ideas to jumpstart you on your next project. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. For more fun sewing videos, subscribe to the AGF channel. Leave us a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Until next time, happy sewing.